Well, first of all, we, I want to say that we're very happy that the report is finally out. It should have been out a long, long time ago. Nothing has surprised us uh, in the report other than the rather shocking number of attempted suicides. Um, uh, but apart from that, uh, what the audit shows is that it is a fragmented, very uncoordinated system that we have as regards mental health provision, which is what we already knew. Well, surely important that the issues actually get sorted. Why is it so important that the report gets published? Well, yes, the issues need to be tackled, but I think as a, as a society and, and in our case as, a, as an NGO that campaigns for, the, for better provision of mental health care for, for people in general, that we have a right to know what the audit says. We, we contributed to the audit. So I think that is very true and I think it, it also holds the government responsible and, and we can monitor, people can monitor whether the government is actually going to deliver I mean, they say they're going to deliver, but we have to monitor whether they actually deliver or not. And how would you say the failings relate to real people's sufferings? Well, it, the, what, what happens here, I mean, you've got lots of things about clarifying uh, referral pathways, establishing clear referral pathways, establishing clear patient pathways. We have always said that the system is a difficult one to navigate, that people get lost in the system, that people don't know who to access and maybe they do get some kind of um, support at some point but then afterwards they feel abandoned because there isn't enough support in the community so all this this uncoordination this lack of coordination translates into people just feeling that they're not being supported in the system basically it's that that they feel that on their own that they don't know how to access the help they need well mark mental health the problem that doesn't seem to be going away in fact everything suggests that it's getting bigger so how important do you feel it is that issues are tackled now yes it's it is important and one of the things that i think is really crucial now that we've been asking for data for a very long time for many many years I mean, data is important because if we know for example that huge amount of attempted suicide plus others which are probably not um, you know, part of the records. Um, why are they happening? Is there a particular group? Is there something we can do to prevent that so that it's not just a burden on mental health? We don't have to look at the report now. Okay, so now the GHA have to take action. As a community, we have to take action. What is going wrong? Um, are there issues with, you know, with parenting? Are there issues with the legal system? Are there issues with, I don't know, access housing. to anything? Housing, for example. So can those be sorted? If we can sort those, homelessness, if we can sort those, we won't be needing to access mental health provision. And I think that's important. So we're delighted that the report is out. Um, and I think government has been quite brave now to get it out. I mean, they probably didn't have a choice. We weren't going to stop anyway. Uh, but I think it's crucial that now it's not that people don't say, OK, so now the GHA need to take action. No, we all need to take action. We all need to stop this stigma. We've got to move away from that. Um, you know, there's nothing wrong when someone suffers, you know, continued stress. Continued stress uh, in st real stressful, uh, you know, issues will cause a mental health issue. Um, it's not just a medical thing. Would you also like to see a timescale for the implementation of measures? I think we're looking forward to meeting at some point with a lady who is going to be directing some, I think she's going to be coordinating something. So, so of course we want it to happen. We want to, as what Conchita said, we want to be monitoring that things, you know, uh, will happen. A lot of the things in the report we have already been saying for many, many years. So, you know, we are excited about the time frame, but we want it to be relatively quick.